Hello YouTube people uh, We all know how much the transmitter is through batteries But Hapsan was kind enough to provide a JST plug So we can use a 7.4 volt LiPo The only problem I had was to find the correct size to fit the battery bay I didn't want to take the plastic holder out and I didn't want to break it so as to be able to use AA batteries again if I wanted to uh, so I got this battery and this is a Gular C 1200 milliamps battery uh, try to take it out just pulled it, it's, very, it's a very tight fit it's not a perf perfect fit it fits very tightly and I had uh, to modify it to fit I unwrapped the thick plastic it was wrapped this with, that has the, the Gular C logo on and the letters and I then dressed it with uh, clear wrapping I had to protect the cells then I put this black uh, high strength uh, tape so I could I could pull it out without uh, using the cables so as not to damage them now let's see how it measures it is uh, let's see it is 16 millimeters thick yes now let's measure yes 15 to 16 millimeters thick this is um, 30 millimeters 30 millimeters it's all right it fits uh, perfectly the problem with this with the width it has to be less than 16 15 millimeters to fit perfectly and the height is uh, let's see the height now let's open this thing up the height is uh, 70 millimeters After the mods, I'm happy with it. It fits uh, snugly, but it fits nicely. Yes, yeah, 70 millimeters. This battery, after two or three flights, it loses one bar on the screen, on the transmitter screen. So I charge it before I use it again I feel more secure flying with full batteries especially in the winter let's put it back in, yes it fits ok leave some space for the cables let's put this plug this, ok, plugged it Put the cables in. Put the. It fits nice. Okay. So, thanks for watching.